fun in it. Now our next guest is the hairstyling genius who the Princess of Wales turns to in order to achieve that iconic bouncy blow, which is now known by many of us as the Chelsea blow dry. Yeah, you say that like I didn't know what it was. <laughs> I did have to ask, didn't <laughs> you I? Did, you I did, did have did. to ask. But like, once you said it, I know what you mean. Yeah. But yeah, look, you don't need to go to a hair salon to achieve that look. Why? Because Richard Ward's here and he's going to tell you all how to do it. We like a hair hack. We like a hair hack, <laughs> and I've got lots of tips for everybody at home. Right. I think I think people are often very scared about the heated appliances, so I've got three models here. Um, I'm going to go through how to use your straighteners. So many people have straighteners at home, but do you know that you can curl with them? And mm. so many people that do curl with them don't know how to do it. Yeah, and it's they the get motion, the and you isn't can it? Burn yourself mm -hmm, as well. Mm -hmm. So, so what we've got here, we've got electric here. So I've I've got two sides here. So look, just show you everybody the straighteners. Now this is the sort of size straightener that is sort of one okay. size fits all. I think this is the one, the classic mm -hmm. one that most people have. And you can see that I've just absolutely just straightened her hair, just silky, silky smooth. But it's worth saying that. People don't realise that you have to prep your hair first before you use the straighteners. If I could give everybody at home one tip today, that is to try and blow dry your hair first the best you can and then put the straighteners on. The mistake people make is that they rough dry their hair and it's frizzy right. and it's all over the place and then they're yanking the straighteners through the hair, which is splitting it and damaging so it. So you're almost using the straighteners to perfect what you've already done? It's, yes, it shouldn't be totally relied on. Okay. And mm -hmm. I think that's the mistake a lot of people make. Now, did you also know that you can curl with the straighteners? Now, the whole point of, of me coming on this morning is to show that you can actually straighten your hair at home. Now, I hope Electra... Yes, you have got them on. So, <laughs> now Electra's going to show you, and I'm going to explain. I've actually pre done some curls with the straightener first. So, obviously, you know that the straightener on this side is, just speaks for itself. And if, I, if Electra just carries on... So, you clamp the hair slowly, slowly, darling, slowly, tip it back on itself 180 degrees... OK. ..and pull it through the hair. Now, remember... It's gliding through the hair now because we prepped it well and that's what you can do at home. You prep it well using a heat-resistant spray. And just a tip I can oh, give yeah, you... Oh, wow! See? Faster you pull the straightener through the hair, the, the, the looser the curl, the slower you pull it through, the, 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 the um, tighter the curl. Right, OK. Wow. So, so the, yeah, faster the fast you is pull what it I would through. like, like that sort of beachy wave. Beachy wave. wave. That is, so pull it through fast and that will give you a beachy okay. wave. Slower will give you a tighter curl. And the angle, you said, is like, is, is sort of, is it going away from your face? Clamp it. So if you're looking in the mirror, and you, mm -hmm. you, you, everybody will need a mirror to do this, but you look in the mirror and you clamp it. Electric, if you just hold it up again, if you clamp it, and then you turn it back on itself, yeah. 180 degrees, and then you pull it okay, through. Okay. And you do everything away from the, everything away so you from the face. You don't really need, uh, you know, like typically you'd have a set of straighteners, maybe a tong. Like you don't actually need all the different appliances if you can just get it the right the right motion. I just know I'm going to try and do this with my girls when I go home if they let do their, it? let their dad. Can do we their just hair? have a little thing before? Well, you brush afterwards. it out afterwards a little bit. Yes, you brush to it, make out it like afterwards and look at that. that oh wow, that's beautiful, magic. Beautiful, beautiful beachy waves. Love it. And don't be frightened. A lot of people are frightened to brush their hair through, but please don't be. Just keep brushing it, because when you've actually used the straighteners, the curl never goes. Yeah, wow. you don't get the drop. Oh, it's so nice. Perfect. How long will it stay like that? That should stay... It, well, it depends on your hair type. Mm. But that is the one great thing about the straighteners, is that because it's heat, a heated appliance, it will last you long. Okay. I'd love to think that by the end of today, they will still be there. Perfect. Crazy. OK, what have we got next? OK, so what we've got next, we've, we've got Ifat. So it, this is my Chelsea blow dry. This is what I'm really known for. So how do you achieve that? So the key is for me is that a lot of people um, blow dry their hair, rough dry their hair far, far, far too much first. Mm -hmm. And what we're trying to do to get hair to shine, so when your hair is wet, imagine all the molecules in the hair are all over the place. We need to get them to lie flat, like a fish's scale okay. or like a flat roof, tiles on a flat roof. That is what's going to make your hair shine. So if I just hand this to Ifat there, she's mm -hmm. going to show you. And the fringe I've given her is a really on-trend fringe at the moment. Ifat has it's great just, hair yes. anyway. Yeah, yeah. She? very she does. She's got amazing hair. So let me... Oh, let me... Oh. Hold on, darling. <laughs> me... It's very natural-looking, Ifat. Uh, yes, 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 <laughs> right. yes, yes. Could be a hairdresser yourself. Right. So the, the secret is, is to have the nozzle behind the hair, just behind the brush, and that is what's straightening in the hair. You must have a nozzle on your hairdryer. 
that also makes those <laughs> molecules sit she flat. Just, sorry, <laughs> I just looked terrified there for a moment. <laughs> sorry. Sorry, but it was all happening at once. It was just like, oh. It was. <laughs> And so, so, yes, that was going to make your hair look really flat and shiny. So this is the Chelsea Glow. Oh, wow. Glow. See, look at that. Yes, it's, and... it's all about this gorgeous, glamorous, aspirational kind of hair that everybody wants. Everybody wants their hair to shine. And if you have, like, like my hair is obviously naturally really curly, so if I'm blow-drying it, it, it can go quite frizzy or a bit fly away. So it, the nozzle's quite important for that, isn't it? If I give you one tip today, try and do your hair from 80% wet. Right. And also use a, a powerful hairdryer, and the nozzle is absolutely... Absolutely key yeah. because that is going to make those molecules in the hair lay flat and that in turn makes your hair shine. Okay. I recognise okay. that. I've seen that in the bathroom. Right. I may have even used it without knowing what it is. <laughs> That's a serum. A good serum. Right. There we go. I think you've probably stolen that from <laughs> someone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In the bath. OK, um, we've got Kelly next. So, Kelly, so we're going from sort of really quite thick, frizzy hair. So, Kelly's got the absolute opposite. Now, I know so many of you are at home likes to use like to use velcro rollers mm -hmm. and they're always wanting people say to me clients of mine say i can't get the volume that i really need out of the velcros and that's because you're putting them in wrong so the key is is let me just take these out first the key is to again get tension in the hair let me just steal that brush from you my darling the tension in the hair, so this here, and now, by the way, this is an, another on-trend fringe, which is exactly what the Princess of Wales has at the moment. So it's what's called this curtain fringe. Okay. Now, this suits nearly everybody too, because what it does, you have wear it in a middle parting, and then you wear it off your face. So, so it's you know, sort of framing your it, face. It's framing the face, exactly. So okay. Kelly's gonna just show you how to put this Velcro roller in very quickly. If I can give you that, hold it there, sweet. There you go. You're going to hold the giant and hold the brush. That's it. That's it. Now she's got it. There we go. It's tricky, there we go. Isn't it? It's, it's, you know it's tricky. No, it's we all should, about getting tension in the hair. No mirrors tension in the That's yeah. the way to do it. Tension in the hair. Remember, the section shouldn't be any bigger than the roller itself. Ah, but let me okay. show you when we're putting the rollers in. The biggest tip I can give you: lots of tension in the hair. Pull the roller forward and then roll it back. So, and I You're always like sure it's quite tight. yeah, really, really tight. And I always clip it with a clip. Secure it with a clip so okay. it doesn't move around all over the place. And then when I take it out, we are going to, you'll see what we're going to get. So I did set um, Kelly's hair completely on those red Velcro rollers. So the key is, is to try and do your hair from about 80% wet and oh, put yeah, the rollers in, in lovely sections. Oh, look at that. And there yes. we have Va -va the on-trend curtain fringe, probably the trendiest fringe at the moment. And also with Ifat there as well, she's got that fringe on the side, which really okay. suits everybody. Amazing. So if you're going to the salon and you want a fringe, a curtain fringe is what you're asking curtain for. Curtain fringe or one on the side. OK. I Perfect. just love the magic Thank of the you. brush and the reveal. It's yeah. brilliant. Do you know, I love this magic of this it's brush. It's amazing. <laughs> Richard, thanks so much. Thank you so much. And thank oh, you, ladies. Thanks, thank thanks, thank you. We'll, we'll give you mirrors next time. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> My daughters, daddy's coming with the old straightener. No, I'll be doing gosh. your hair this run, weekend. Girls, run. <laughs> <laughs> it's time to.